Hey, what's up everybody? It's Chu over here at Low Auto Sports. Welcome to the Wednesday Weekly Tip of the Week. This week, the question I'm going to answer is, when should I start my detailing business? So the only correct time to start is now. I've often talked to individuals who, we've, who, who will tell me, hey, I want to start a business. I'm not sure how to do this. I'm not sure how to do that. And, um, you know, if, if you have the opportunity, maybe go work at a dealership, go work at another detail shop and learn some of the things, learn some of the process. Um, and maybe you can learn using the tools that are not necessarily yours, but you can at least get familiar with some products some compounds and you will get your hands on some paint before you have to do it on your own. That is definitely one way you can do it. Now, the way I did it is I literally uh, got shown by a family member of mine how to do it. I did it on my Miata and um, we started within a month. So I had one car under my belt and we started a business. So that is not the way I recommend doing it. Um, but it just goes to show that there's, any, there's many which way to do it and there's really no correct way. I, I think the most correct way is to just get the ball rolling. Um, a lot of individuals will ask me, uh, for the right timing and, and to be honest there's no right timing because a lot of the process that's being that you learn because a lot of the things that you're gonna learn are, are gonna be learned um, on the job right it's just like when you have it when you've picked up a new job in the past most of the things that you've learned a lot of times were in the field uh, whether it's doing sales or working at a tire shop a lot of the things I learned in the field so running a business is kind of the same way you can do everything that you want to to prep and you should I would have done SBA classes, which is a small business administration, which you probably have them in your state. Those are free, great resource. I would have read some business books, but even done, doing all that, I think I still would have had to learn a ton because part of running a business is not only learning your skills, being able to do the skills, but it's also having the ability to speak to your clients, how to have effective communication between you and client, and uh, how to build a brand as well, because that's, that's really crucial and important. So my advice is just get a business name together, start calling your friends and family, start some, get some tools together, start working on cars, and just get busy. Um, when you're in it, you're in it. There's no coming out of it once you're in. So once you're in, you will, you're gonna give 100% of your effort because you're gonna wanna succeed. Uh, at least I hope so. So that's all I got for you. If you're still thinking about when you should start your detailing business, I urge you to just start now. Um, you know, you can look back on this time today in five years and say, man, I should have started earlier. Well, why not just start today? And then five years later on, you can say, hey, I've got five years of experience, which is that you cannot buy. Time is a commodity you cannot buy, right? We can't get any more of that. So don't waste your time. Get after it and... Good luck with your business. If you get any questions, please leave them in the comments below. I will get back to them, and I will see you guys next Wednesday for further tips.